Investigators hoping convicted killer David Sweat continues to talk this morning. The former fugitive's condition now improving after being shot twice in the torso Sunday. He's going to be brought back to the Department of Corrections when he's cleared. Um, medically. Police wanting answers to exactly how Sweat and Richard Matt planned and executed their escape from the maximum security prison. 35 year old Sweat already confessing that he and Matt initially planned on running away to Mexico with former prison worker Joyce Mitchell. They would kill Mitchell's husband and then get in the car and drive to Mexico. When Mitchell didn't show up, the duo headed toward Canada instead. But 18 days after their escape, the men separated. Sweat telling investigators 49-year-old Matt was slowing him down. A source telling CNN there's evidence Matt was sick, possibly from contaminated food or water. An examination of his body found blisters on his feet and minor cuts. Uh, you know, for as intelligent as these guys are, breaking out of a maximum security prison, uh, evading police for three weeks, Joyce Mitchell was plan A. Both men were found dressed for the woods. Inside Sweat's bag, there were tools, bug spray, maps, and Pop-Tarts. Authorities say Matt's body reeked of alcohol. The inmate's DNA initially found inside this cabin, along with an opened bottle of grape gin. And there was nice cooking gear. There was a, hmm. a um, barbecue. There was beds. Uh, it, it looked pretty well equipped for a place that far out in the woods.